chums, it's Bobs, and welcome to my May favorites. So I hope you guys have been well and I know quite a few of you guys are still working hard in your exams. So you know, if you're still at it, keep it going guys. Remember, it's good to work hard and be productive but it's also important to stay hydrated and get rest and be well fed. And to those who finally finished your exams, yes! But lately, I really haven't been sleeping well at all like seriously the concealer that i was using before just wasn't doing the trick i know there's a lot of night oils out there and you guys probably don't get a lot of sleep i don't know from gaming studying watching k-drama marathons but yeah the dark circles just don't make us feel very pretty my brand concealers have always been legendary and it's when i go back to it that i realize oh my gosh <laughs> where were you you know why did i go off i'm so sorry but i'm back to you if you're looking for a high coverage concealer that does not cake underneath your eyes, this is great because first of all, like I said before, it you know it's got great coverage. It's so creamy, so you know it just blends in beautifully under your skin area. It doesn't crease. And with this, I can just fake 10 hours sleep. It's just a really, really great concealer that I highly recommend, guys. Oh, oh. Now I'm moving on, let's talk about nails. You know, for like spring and summer, I don't think there's any color that just stands out and just makes you feel more than um, like a minty color. I don't know what it is about the hot weather that just really makes me gravitate towards, um, you know, pastel, like ice creamy color, just colors that remind me dessert. I love Etta House and I love their nail polishes. They have such a huge range. I wish I own them all and they're pretty inexpensive as well you know and they have cute packaging but just an absolute beautiful color that makes me feel very very summery i think it's definitely a true like tiffany blue blue as you can see this is uh the makeup forever hd pressed powder how can i describe this powder um it's basically like photoshop for your pores it really blurs out the skin really making your skin look poreless and flawless so even though it looks white don't get startled because on the skin it's actually translucent so don't worry so it's great because it absorbs the oil modifies the skin just gives you a very natural finish because it is HD powder no matter how much I slap this on it doesn't make my skin look heavy and it really does make your skin look flawless while keeping my skin matte for summer. Okay, now next product is also a Makeup Forever product and surprise, surprise, it's a lip product and it's actually also um, a product you guys ask me a lot. So if you guys watch my vlogs, I wear this lipstick a lot and there's a reason for it because I feel like this lipstick is like kind of like my secret weapon. When I have it on, I just look more together because I, I don't really wear a lot of makeup. Most of the time I don't even wear makeup, but I just put on this lipstick and it's just amazing how much more perked up I feel with this lipstick. And it's just a beautiful matte, uh, vibrant pink. And it makes my teeth look extra white as well. It makes anybody's teeth look extra white, which is awesome. Uh, the great thing about wearing vibrant pink is it also makes your overall complexion look a lot healthier as well. But if you have dry lips, then definitely I recommend to wear a lip balm underneath because I find with all matte lipsticks, they they don't feel as moisturizing. So if your lips chap easily, then definitely wear a lip balm. I say this all the time, guys, but if you want to look more together and healthy, just put on a brighter lip color and I promise you, you will look 10 times more healthier. So it's kind of like my lazy makeup trick to go because I really can't be bothered like putting all my eye makeup or foundation or concealer a lot of the time. But a lipstick makes all the difference, like trust me. So I want to show you guys these little books first and these are actually all from my subscribers and you guys are so sweet, you guys know me well and they look so cute and I actually keep these in my vanity table. The one I want to show you guys today is called um, Today I Am Thankful. So it's not just because it's adorable, because it's mint, it's pretty and it's got the golden sides. Every day before I go to bed, I note down what I am grateful for and it's just such a great way to end my night. And it's so nice reading back to all the things that I'm grateful for. And even if I'm in a bad mood, sometimes when I go back and I start reading these, I just feel so lucky and blessed again. And I think it's something that, you know, we should all do. You know, last entry I wrote was last night, of course. And 
I wrote, uh, today I'm grateful because Tim finally felt our baby kick. Gratitude brings a wonderful sense of fulfillment. Make time to treasure the moments in your day, big and small. Create a beautiful keepsake to inspire you for years to come. So isn't that beautiful? And you know, of course, if you want to get this one, it's really adorable and I think it's great, but you don't have to use this. You can just use an ordinary notebook. You guys may have noticed that I've been wearing this pink sweater a lot and it's actually from H&M. I suddenly have this love for this adorable pink. I think it's just so cute for summer. And I also got it in the blue. It's just a simple, like flimsy, loose, fit jumper with one pocket aside. I really like wearing sweaters where it just has like one pocket in the sides. But you know, I've just really been into like just basic shapes. And stuff like this you can wear for years and years rather than wearing something that just goes out of style like really quickly. It looks effortless, but it looks, you know, cute and just put together. The foodie product, I've really been loving eating strawberries. So, <sighs> must be the sweet tooth craving. I don't know, but I'm just craving sugar all the time so fruit is just one of the best ways to satisfy my sugary cravings and plus do you know that eating strawberries actually whiten your teeth naturally this is my roto v eye drops and i don't know why it is but maybe because it's getting hot and you know we're using aircon more um, my eyes are just really dry. Maybe you're like me, you're always sitting in front of a computer screen. Sometimes it just makes your eyes feel so strained or even from reading or studying your eyes just... I mean, it is a nice cool minty sensation but it's not like the extreme ones. I pretty much bring this everywhere with me. I bring this in my handbag. It's nice and small. It's a cute packaging. It looks like a small perfume bottle. Whenever my eyes start to feel tired or it gets red or it feels dry and strained, I just apply one drop to my eyes. Sometimes when I wake up and I'm just like, oh, it's so early, I'm so sleepy, I just, you know, put this in my eyes and right away, I just feel more awake and more fresh. All right, guys, so these are my May favorites and I hope you guys enjoy chilling with me. Thank you so much for watching. I will be flying off to the UK in a few days for Tim's sister's wedding. So remember to subscribe to my vlog channel to keep up with us and I shall see you very soon. Bye, everybody!